Rick Ness Heartbreaking Update Hope keep watching for more details. Hi guys, what's up? My name is Lemon. Welcome back to my channel, like this video, and enjoy this video. Don't miss the main topic of this video. So let's start the latest update. At the center of season 14, Rick Ness, the indomitable mind boss, is mining his way to a record-breaking million doll season. In the wild world of gold mining, where fortunes rise and fall like the undulating Klondike terrain, one man has emerged as a resilient force to be reckoned with. The journey started in Season 9 when Rick Ness emerged from behind the scenes of his former employer, Parker Schnobel, to lead his own crew. Undeterred by the challenges that lay ahead, Ness proved himself to be a formidable force extracting a commendable 115 of gold in his debut solo season, a testament to his grit and determination. However, it was in season 11 that he truly found his footing, overcoming setbacks to clear a staggering $2 million in gold mining, a remarkable 1080 o. The season marked a turning point for NES as he acknowledged the steep learning curve of being a miner. Boss unfazed by previous setbacks against all odds, Rick Ness achieved his goal of mining an impressive 2047 0 in Season 12, setting an ambitious goal that seemed insurmountable as he started the season without a complete crew. However, the story took an unexpected turn in Season 13, when Rick Ness, struggling with seasonal depression and personal challenges, made the difficult decision to step away from the show, leaving fans wondering about his future in the gold. Rich Wilderness, following a break from the gold mining and recovery industry. In season 14, Rick Ness triumphantly returned, taking a risk by selling his mother's house to fund the revival of his mining business. Start a venture with a small initial investment as the current season progresses, NES put together a haphazard operation with used gear and unwavering will to rejoin the fray. Halfway through season 14, spectators are enthralled with Ness's perseverance and the drama that is developing around his search for gold. He has already extracted an astounding 46,121 Oz, suggesting that he may surpass the coveted 1,000 to 2,000 Oz by the conclusion of the season. Rickness's transformation from an inexperienced miner to an accomplished mind ruler is very amazing. Breaking even in season 10 might not have been the massive haul he aimed for, but it showcased his resilience in the face of challenges in season 11 NES, and his teen's recovery of $2 million in gold highlighted their ability to bounce back from setbacks learning from the roller coaster experience of being a mining team boss. The fact that he achieved a significant milestone of 115 in his first solo season is a testament to his dedication and hard work. In season 12, Rick Ness set an ambitious goal of 2,000 ounces, overcoming crew setbacks and using heavy-duty equipment. He not only achieved his goal but surpassed it, mining an astounding 2047 ounces. This achievement firmly established Rick Ness as a force to be reckoned with within the gold mining industry. The hiatus during season 13 due to personal issues showcases this. In these improved consistently, ultimately reaching an impressive 1080 o the human side of Rick Ness, but his impressive comeback in season 14. He even sold his mother's house to raise the money for his venture exhibits his everlasting dedication to the gold mining industry. In the first half of season 14, 46,121 ounces suggests that NES is well on his way to once again exceeding his own expectations. As he continues to navigate the challenges of the conduct, Rick NES' story continues to be an inspiring example of the perseverance, determination, and constant learning that characterize a true gold miner. His accomplishments not only speak to his prowess in the field, but they also serve as a testament to his resilience. As a devoted gold rush spectator, I have witnessed Rick Nesbitt's journey, 
which is a tale of success created of passion and guts. His perseverance in the face of hardship and resolve to forge his own way in the uncertain world of gold mining have left an enduring mark Rick Ness's transformation from a rookie miner learning the ropes under Parker Schnabel's instruction to a mind boss, leading his own team is evidence of his perseverance. What most impresses me is his capacity for growth and adaptation, which is demonstrated by each season's development. Season 10's setbacks, Season 11's victorious triumph, and Season 12's bold aim all demonstrate a guy who not only embraces but also overcomes obstacles. Ness's brave return in Season 14, marked by a significant personal sacrifice, highlights his passion for gold mining and determination to reclaim his former glory. His decision to step away during Season 13 due to personal issues humanizes his journey and reminds us that even the toughest phase trials. Observing Rick NES dig for a record-breaking breaking the $2 million mark in Season 14 is a testimonial to his unwavering spirit in the pursuit of achievement and feels like supporting an old friend. Hi everyone, welcome back to my Gold Rush channel. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Rick NES found himself in the middle of the Alaskan wilderness, where the bitter cold can cut through even the thickest of jackets and the steep terrain can challenge even the most seasoned prospectors. He was faced with the ultimate test of his perseverance and ability to overcome hardships despite the difficult and rewarding road. Rick was clueless that beneath his feet, the frozen ground held the secret to a season that would win him an incredible four million dollars. With an unshakable conviction in his eyes, Rick stood in front of his crew as the sun set, casting long shadows across the snow-covered countryside. There was something unusual about this season. It was loaded with the weight of dreams and the promise of good fortune. They had gathered around the makeshift campfire, and the flames were dancing, reflecting the glimmer of hope that burned within each of them. The air was thick with expectation as they did so. Rick's steadfast conviction that taking a risk would result in results that had never been seen before was the driving force behind his courageous decision to stake a claim in a new region. Rick was not the type of person to shy away from taking a chance, despite the fact that the veterans had cautioned him about the difficulties that were to come with a firm handshake and a steely resolve he led his group into unfamiliar terrain where the murmurs of gold resonated through the freezing hair he was determined to reach his destination during the early days the crew encountered a number of obstacles as they fought against the brutal elements in the soil which was adamant about keeping its secrets to itself the leadership that Rick displayed however showed through and his positivity was contagious even when confronted with challenges every hurdle was viewed as a stepping stone on the path to the elusive treasure that was concealed beneath the frozen surface and every failure was received with a newfound sense of purpose when Rick made the decision to go further than he ever had before he was motivated by his intuition and a gut feeling that he was unable to fully describe this was the moment that marked the turning point the ground came way, revealing a brilliant vein of gold that seemed to stretch into infinity. Rick's conviction ended up being the guiding light for the crew, even if it was a risky move that made them doubt their captain's sanity. At that moment, Rick stood there, his face wearing a look that was equal parts triumphant and shocked as the excavators started to roar to life. The team's cries of discovery could be heard throughout the immense desert. The crew, who had previously been warm out and exhausted, now worked with a renewed sense of vitality, their hands moving with purpose. The story of Rickness's triumph spread like wildfire attracting the attention of prospectors from all over the world. A once desolate campsite was transformed into a busy center of activity as miners from adjacent claims came to witness the spectacle of riches unfolding before their very eyes. Triumph and amazement that the risk had been well worth it and the prediction of a season that would bring in $4 million was now a sparkling reality. 
The season that brought in $4 million was not just a fantasy. Rather, it was a reality that exceeded all of our greatest fat FES when the land that had been frozen over thought revealed a treasure trove that would permanently alter the lives of Rick and his crew. On the other hand, Rick maintained his focus on the task at hand, making sure that every single ounce of gold was painstakingly retrieved and tracked down. The astounding scale of Rick's finding became more and more apparent as the days turned into weeks and the weeks evolved into months on the other side. However, the season that brought in $4 million was not just a fantasy, but a reality that exceeded all of our greatest fant FES. Ever the strategist, Rick came up with an absurdly well-planned plan that involved sleds, cars, and even helicopters. The package was successfully transported during the crew's daring mountain routes and cold river crossings. Despite the dangers, they never took their eyes off the brilliant gold that symbolized their hard-earned fortune. The story of Rick Ness's season-long $4 million earnings also spread outside of Alaska. The entire globe watched in awe as the story of the underdog who beat all odds and struck gold against all expectations captured the imaginations of both ambitious prospectors and casual explorers. At the same time, Rick's journey became a representation of strength and perseverance, a testament to the human spirit that cannot be broken by the challenges that come with venturing into the unknown. Success, however, did not change the story. Throughout the entire expedition, Rick Ness remained the same grounded, hardcore gold prospector who had set out on this journey with nothing more than a pickaxe and a desire. Rick made thoughtful decisions, making sure that the spirit of the Alaskan wilderness and his crew's friendship were never jeopardized. Although his newfound money presented opportunities, Rick succeeded in keeping neither of these concepts compromised. Rick Ness's name will always be inscribed in the annals of gold mining history because of the $4 million season that turned into a lasting legacy. The formerly modest Wisconsin prospector had become a legend, and his story had motivated a new generation of seekers of wealth to set out on their own expeditions in search of the enigmatic golden metal as the seasons changed and the icy stillness of the Alaskan wilderness returned. Rick Ness served as a live embodiment of the notion that occasionally, in the most unexpected places, one may uncover not only gold, but also the pure essence of human potential. One living example of this was Rick Ness. Thanks for watching my video.